I'm like afraid to be excited, which is sad, but it, it, this would be really early. I think this would be like not even four weeks. Hey guys, good morning. It's 4.30 in the morning and I'm about to take a pregnancy test. So uh, let me just tell you guys, <laughs> this, this light is very bright. I just woke up. So I've been trying, like we've been trying for a few months and it's been negative. So I like used to film it every time and then I was getting really discouraged so I stopped. But then two days ago I took a test and I didn't film it and I got a faint line. So my period is supposed to be tomorrow. So I'm going to take another test today, see if the line's any darker. And I decided to actually film it because maybe it's positive this time so i'm just gonna take this right now i'm down in the kitchen because we is sleeping and Brittany and cj are upstairs sleeping too so i just came downstairs to take this real quick so i just had to pee really bad so i was like let's let's just get this over with <laughs> so let's see I'm shaking and I'm not even gonna flip it over like usually I flip it upside down and then there's a whole big reveal I'm just gonna let it um just sit normally so I guess it'll take like three minutes and then I'll have my answer I'm so tired so my mouth is dry <laughs> kind of like when I was checking for when I was pregnant with Amelia, my mouth got dry. But, yeah, I'm trying not to get too excited because I had so many disappointments. So, yeah, the faint line the other day kind of surprised me. But I just didn't, I just pretended like I didn't see anything and waited a few more days. So, we'll see. So more minutes I don't know if I'm gonna sleep again after this but <laughs> I just had to check by the way this lighting is great <laughs> this is the new kitchen lighting I'm gonna have to just film videos right here like this is perfect I'm seeing two lines you guys it's not even been two minutes and I'm already seeing two lines. <sighs> oh my god. I'm just like, I don't know, I'm just trying not to get too excited. Because last month I thought I was and then I wasn't and I don't know what that was about but it was really upsetting. I'm just like trying not to look at it, even though I just saw the two lines. Well, <laughs> I need some water. I'm shaking. <laughs> so, oh my god. I'm like afraid to be excited, which is sad, but. It, it, this would be really early. I think this would be like not even four weeks. So. <laughs> Happy New Year. Today's New Year's Eve. <sighs> yeah, I've been. Like, I'm just honestly, I just am. I want to be excited, but I'm just nervous. I don't know. I shouldn't be, but I'm going to show you guys the test now. I'm shaking. <laughs> Can you see the two lines? I just don't know what to say. It's just been 
I've, I thought I wanted to get pregnant so bad in the summer, but I was waiting because I wanted a few more months for my body to get ready and then when we started trying and it wasn't happening, it got really disappointing and I know that a lot of people try for a really long time but because we didn't really, really try once with Amelia and got pregnant so I got super nervous and then it just kept going negative and then last month I was like 100% convinced I was pregnant because I had symptoms of pregnancy, I was tired I was feeling, um, I was going to the bathroom a lot I just felt pregnant and then when I started bleeding I was just like I really lost my mind because I thought like do I not know my body and I never got a positive test because I think it was too early but that kind of really scared me so I don't really know what happened and like there's no way I can confirm what happened but it was a really hard month last month and so that's why I'm like holding back right now to get excited because I don't want to I don't want to get excited and then bleed again so I'm just gonna stay hopeful so I'm gonna go back to bed <laughs> and yeah that's it, I'll see you guys later hey guys, it has been a few hours since I took the pregnancy test I'm still in disbelief but I'm gonna be calling my OB at some point this morning to schedule a blood test to confirm the pregnancy and yeah i already told hui i didn't film it or anything because he already kind of knew because i told him about the faint line two days ago so yeah he's just like hey foxy he said he whispered to my belly hey foxy this is your father speaking <laughs> so we're joking saying it's foxy our prediction is a boy but who knows we'll see um, and Brittany knows she's coming to the car. She's still here. Here she comes. So we're gonna go to Paris Baguette. She's this is her last day here um, for the visit. So she's gonna come in. Let's get her reaction. I already told her, but you guys can see her. Baby on board. You're saying it right now? Well, not this. No one's gonna see this for like two <laughs> months. But yeah, I'm saying it right now. Yay! So Brittany's one of the first to know. Tell them how I told you. Okay, well, first she, so we had to take a test to come here. Cause COVID we test. To be safe um, for my little niecey. And so Audrey was also going to take one just to, you know, do both sides. I took one because I was like sniffling and I was like, what is wrong with me? So oh, I took a COVID well, test. Well, you didn't tell me you were sniffling, but anyways. Yeah, well, I was because, yeah. Anyways, so... I was in the middle of packing in New York and she's blowing up my phone and I didn't look at it until we got in the car to go because, you know, I was packing, I was saying goodbye to my in-laws and all that nice stuff. To in-laws! And so she like said, Brittany, I took a test, it might be positive. And then she sent me a picture and it was like a very faint line, but you could definitely see that there yeah, was a line. Yeah, it was a pregnancy test. I was trying to make her think the COVID test was positive to scare her for one second, but then she didn't even reply, so I was just like ruined it. And she was like, well, anyways, here's the other test. I'm yeah, negative, yeah. come yeah, over. Yeah, 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 come over. And so when I finally saw it, I was like, uh, that does look like a line, and I called her. And I was like, I don't know if it's a line, we're gonna find out, we're gonna wait a couple days. Yeah, so she's like, well, I maybe, get too excited. maybe I'll take one like right before you guys go. And mm -hmm. so I was like, okay, yeah. okay, okay. Um, I literally woke up to her texting me saying she was in the shower, which I was about to get in the shower. So hmm. I was like, oh, okay, I'll wait. And then I got in the shower and she came in and I was showering and she goes, so Brittany. And she showed me and it was two very clear defined two lines. lines. Two lines. It's still, it's still light because I looked on like the tracker and it says I would be like three weeks, six days. Yeah. Which yeah. is very, very, very early. early. But. <coughs> Crazy. 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 I'm going to have another niece or nephew. Yeah. What do you think it's going to be? Boy or girl? I know who he wants a boy. Yeah, but what do also, you think it's gonna he be? he had, I'm gonna go with my logic from last time because you guys had girl, dad had girls, his parents had girl first and then they had a boy so I think 
I think he's gonna have a boy. You do? Yeah. I think so too. I really we'll do. find out. Yep. Yay! 